please welcome Annette and her son, Blake. <laughs> Annette, why do you think you're having such a hard time to meet men to, to just date? Well, I think that a lot of it has to do with the community I live in. It's a suburban neighborhood. It's the number one city to live in, in the United States. And there are not a lot of single people. Right. Uh, a lot of people move there because the school system's good and they want the kids to get a good education. So what you have is families. You have mothers and fam mothers and fathers, yeah. no single people. Right. What are some qualities that you're looking for in a man? Well, I'd like somebody who's confident, someone who's trustworthy, somebody who is financially secure, mm -hmm. somebody who is actually a kind person. Blake, what type of... Uh guy would you like to see with your mom? Um, mainly somebody that's genuine, somebody that's gonna put her first, uh, someone that's ambitious, and then also someone that's really just has a good mind state about everything, someone that's gonna be positive and, and g give her that extra kick in the morning. <laughs> well, we found three great single guys <laughs> that we think would be good matches for you. Okay. You ready to meet him? Yes. All right, well, let's go. Gentlemen, come on out. <laughs> All right, everybody. Please welcome Scott, Eric, and Carl. <laughs> Fellas, introduce yourself to Annette and her son, Blake. Hi, Annette. I'm Carl, I'm, and I'm glad to be here. I'm a network marketer. I work in the community. I'm a philanthropist for those who can't speak for themselves. I'm looking forward to meeting you today. Eric. Hello, Annette. Hello, Blake. My name is Eric. I'm a practicing attorney and a certified consulting hypnotist. I'm an avid reader. I love playing the piano, working out, and community work. And I'm interested in a lady who is witty, spiritual, and active. Very nice. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Scott. Hey, how are you? I'm Scott. I am a 30-year veteran in the media business. I'm also a college football and high school basketball referee. 20 years ago to this date, I was lucky enough to be an Ebony Bachelor of the Year. That was hard to believe that was 20 years ago, but that was uh, then. And I'm really kind of looking for somebody to take to the next level with me in this last quarter, fourth quarter of life. <laughs> We're not playing. <laughs> this is business. So, Annette, what, what, what do you think so far? I think you got a good group there. Yeah, yeah. It'll be nice, because it's a well-rounded group. These gentlemen are exactly who they say they are. I would like to also say that all of these gentlemen are financially established. They're not looking for no help, but they got plenty if you need it. <laughs> so after the break, we're gonna find out more about these guys, and then Annette's gonna narrow it down and choose which bachelor is gonna make the cut. We're gonna find out when we come back, everybody. Hey, you made it to the end of this video. I got a lot more that you're gonna enjoy, so just click to watch the next one. And make sure you subscribe to always know what's happening.